It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Yonder Beer and it's a bottle of their Cloud Spotting. It's a Sour Saison coming in at 7% ABV. There's a look at the label. 750ml bottle, 7% ABV, oversized bottle cap. So I won't be able to use my Real Ale Guide bottle opener here. Got to use a bigger one. So without further ado, let's get this beer out into a glass, see what we get. We did have a nice fizz on that one, but uh, a hiss, but I was talking over it, so here we go. So Yonder Beer were very kind enough to send me this beer. Thank you very much, Yonder Beer. Look at the sound and the quality on that. You hear that? <coughs> Sounds fabulous. Uh, I think this is my first beer from Yonder. Um, let's have a very, very quick look where they're from. Somerset. Based in Somerset. <coughs> when I put this beer down, I know I like to talk about the appearance of the beer first. But I just had a fantastic of aroma of that sour saison. Definitely sour and definitely saison like. But before I get into the the aroma, we've got to first have a look at the beer. So head, as you've seen, dissipated quite quickly, but we had a one to two finger white head. Um, there's good levels of carbonation there rolling up the glass. It's nice and hazy. Beer is nice and hazy looking. Looks very nice. Let's um, let's get the aroma then on this hazy looking amber coloured beer. Cool, blimey. It's got the aroma of... Oh, I'm just imagining things because it's from Somerset, I'm sure. It's got a real kind of juicy apple, funky smell to it. Of course, Saison. It's going to have that kind of horse blanket mustiness to it, naturally. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. Wow! Oh wow, that's sour! Blimey! Ah! That is... Oh, 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 oh my goodness me! That is one of the sourest beers I've had in months. In months and months and months and months on the channel. Oh my goodness me, stone the crows. Stone the crows. Wow, 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 it's so sour. It just like attacks the inside of your mouth. Think of, go back to when you were a kid, when you used to buy the little kind of lemon spaceships with the, with the sour dust inside and and you used to bite into that foamy spaceship thing and you used to get the dust powder and it used to make your mouth go all you know all sour and crazy like that's exactly that's the when you grow up you stop eating them little flying saucer spaceship things um, but then you naturally gravitate or I've naturally gravitated to sour beer it does exactly the same thing but it's the adult version. Fantastically refreshing. 
really, really, really refreshing. Lovely, lovely beer. My goodness me. Right, flavour. Let's get over let's get over that sourness now and start pulling flavours for you. I'm still getting that sensation of apple. The drinkability is incredible. It's really, really lovely and refreshing. You could whack this bottle, cool it right down in the fridge if you if you so wished, and you'd still get the same flavours. I like well, my, my bar out there now, we're heading into November, well, heading into December slowly, so it's really cold out there at the moment. So all of my beer has made its way into the bar. And yeah, in doing that, it's cooled it down naturally. It's not fridge cold. It's not fridge cold, but it's, it's outside in the conservatory cold. It's about, I reckon, about nine degrees, eight degrees. It's really funky. It's really horse blankety and funky and lemony and spicy and peppery and oh my goodness me. Um, I'm thinking about getting another glass because what I want to show you, or do I just carry on hammering away at it? Um, I want to show you just, uh, the rest of the bottle just to see because there's a lot left. I want you to see the sediment, if there is, oh yeah, that you can see, look. I want to get that sediment from the bottom of the bottle in the glass um, mm -hmm. to be able to really give you the 100% experience of this beer. Sour. Right, here we go. Let's see if we can get this in. I doubt it, but we'll have a go. No, look at the sediment. There it is. Look, look at the sediment. You can still hear that. Beautiful. Carbonation in the in, in the glass there. This is a wonderful, wonderful example. Look, look, there it goes. I managed to fill the glass. Look at that. So that's what the beer looks like with all the, all of that beautiful sediment in. Let's see if it's altered the taste a little bit. I imagine it would have done. Oh. It's made it even sourer. My goodness me. I love it. I love this beer. I'm going to wrap this up. Do I read the label first? Cloud Spotting is a mixed culture fermented saison brewed with the fra fragrant cloud-like flowers of for foraged meadow sweet. The combination of fruity UK grown hops and the funky pineapple like flavours of our wild yeast cultures meld perfectly with the sweet lychee and almond notes of meadow sweet. Proving that you don't need to ship exotic ingredients all around the world to achieve exciting tropical flavours in beer. Produced Yonder Bruin, Blending Limited, The Workshop, Rookery Farm, Radstock in Somerset. I want to go and visit these people. That is amazing. That is amazing beer. Amazing beer. And it's right. You don't need to travel the world to have lychee and passion fruit and mango. Just go and get yourself some of that lovely meadow sweet. Um, that is a brilliant beer. That is a brilliant, brilliant example of a sour beer. It really is. It's incredible. Incredible. Um, I was about to say something and then I decided to... I was going to... Was I going to wrap things up, wasn't I? Wonderfully carbonated, 
fantastic tasting wild sour saison style beer. I would probably look to share that with somebody being in a 750 bottle 7% ABV I would share that you could you could you could share that with three people I think a glass enough of this is I mean I'm gonna drink all mine but that's that's just me but a, a third of this you could get three thirds out of this bottle and uh, it'd be I think it would be enough it would be enough it works out just under a third but rating Wonderfully sour beer from Yonder Beer and Blending. That's for me is a 10 out of 10. It's a 10 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. Absolutely fantastic stuff then from Yonder Brewing. Uh, beer, and, beer and Blending, I think they call themselves. Uh, brewing and Blending. Yonder Brewing, brewing and Blending. Um, yeah, uh, 10 out of 10. Thanks for watching. Put your comments in the comments box. Please subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom. Cheers.